On Wednesday, Group Yvon Michel and Global Legacy Boxing held a press conference at the Air Canada Centre to announce the September 11th Premier Boxing Champions event. The card will be held at the Rico Coliseum in Toronto, Ontario, one day before Floyd Mayweather's potential final bout against Andre Berto. You know, I've retired, I've uh, sat back and I've realized that, you know, boxing's lacking in Canada. You know, going to the Olympics and doing some press work at the Olympics, seeing the uh, Canadian team, it was basically just four people. And I was like, no, this, this is terrible. For, you don't even have every weight class. So we want to build back up the momentum of uh, boxing in Canada. We're going to bring Premier Boxing Champions Series here in Toronto. So it's the first time. It's the beginning of something that's going to set Toronto on a world stage. There's no other sport out there, you know, they're looking at UFC. Anybody can do UFC. But in boxing, you can only... You know, the only catch you basically separate the men from the boys. In the main event, Adana Stevenson defends his lineal light heavyweight title against Tommy Carpensi. It will mark the first world title fight within the Toronto city limits since 1984, when Aaron Pryor defeated Nikki Ferlano. Adonis was named in 2013 the Fighter of the Year by The Ring magazine. The first Canadian, Canadian in 80 years to be named Fighter of the Year. That, that's a dream for me. Uh, to fight in Toronto. Uh, I'm a knockout puncher. I want everybody to uh, show what I can do. Tommy Carpentier is a young contender who, against all odds, he beat Ch Chad Dawson, and this is how he became world ranked. This is how he deserved to fight for the championship. It's a great honor and privilege to be here. Uh, boxing hasn't been here a long time, so I'm glad to be a part of that. On the undercard, fans in attendance will see Dylan Carmen defend his Canadian heavyweight title against 51-year-old Donovan Razor Ruddick. Ruddick is two fights into a comeback and looking to become the oldest Canadian boxing champion with a victory over Carmen. I, I, believe, I believe in something, and I believe that age do not have a factor in what I do. I'm excited for the opportunity. Like Razor said, he hasn't lost any of that power. Don't get it twisted. He's still a very powerful man and, uh, and a smart guy in the ring. And, and he was ranked where he was in the world for a reason, you know, at one time. You need to tell me what is the problem with age. Because if that was the case, Tyson would not be the champion of the world at 19 years old. You know, that was at one time, though. This is a new time. This is my time. So uh, I'm bigger, younger, stronger, faster, smarter, hmm. you know? All of these things I will take into the ring. I'm not going to count on age. I'm not going to put no weight on age at all. I'm putting it on my ability to fight. I respect Razor a lot, but September 11th, that night's my night. The PBC event will air live in the United States on Spike TV and on pay-per-view across Canada.